Dear friends, today I am going to take you on a trip of very interesting concept and that is senses. How children learn through their senses. Everything that children experience in their day to day life involves the use of their senses. Their sight, hearing, taste, smell and touch. And everything they sense is mentally stimulating. They need not only have abundance of sensory experiences but also the opportunity to develop certain concept formation abilities and these abilities are called thinking skills or cognitive skills. The activities which are designed to develop five important mental processes or thinking skills or cognitive skills are matching, classifying, understanding relationships, perceiving patterns and problem solving. These abilities clears the early concepts and also provide the solid base for the mental skills needed in formal school. Today we are going to talk about the first thinking skill, matching skill. We are going to do one activity to enhance the skill. What is matching? Matching involves the ability to understand whether things are the same or different. All five senses can be brought into play in developing matching skills. Children can recognize colors that are same, shapes that are same, textures that are same, smells and tastes that are the same and can, they can also recall smelling and tasting before. There are so many everyday tasks through which children can practice matching. And matching can be pairing slippers or shoes, open the bottles, bottles with their caps. A red sari might call for a red blouse, earrings, socks. There are so many activities which you can do with your child at home. Today's activity is animals puzzles. Aim of this activity is observing similarities and differences and matching. These are puzzle pieces. Child will complete the puzzles by finding the other half of each animal and matching. They can also have fun joining different pieces to make imaginary animals. Now very important part of this matching activity is that you have to ask lot of questions when while doing the activity. For example, you can ask can you name all the animals? Which ones you have seen? Where have you seen? Which one is the biggest? or smallest animal. What all things a monkey does with a tail or an elephant with his trunk? These are very interesting questions that you can ask your child while doing the activity. Now let us go proceed for the activity with two and half year old child. He is going to do the matching activity. Hello friends. Hello. Today we are going to do this matching activity, okay? Okay.
Give me. 